It is breaking news now at noon. A slow pursuit that went for hours, even though the man behind the wheel of the stolen work truck was driving on the rims. Hello and welcome to KCAL News at Noon and streaming on CBS News Los Angeles. I'm Amy Johnson. Now, that chase finally ended in Canoga Park when the driver got out of the truck and gave himself up. And that's where KCAL News reporter Jasmine Beal is live with a look at what happened. Jasmine. Amy, so this three hour chase through the valley ended right here on Canoga Avenue. And here's that stolen work truck. Employees actually just pulled this truck into this parking lot to try to get it up and running again. You can see the damage right here that was done during the chase. It's a suspect hit several different drivers. Eventually, this truck just simply ran out of gas and take a look, ran out of those tires. Some spike strips uh, tore the tires right off the side of this truck on the right hand side. You can see it did the same to the back and even to the trailer, this concrete pump flattening that tire as well. Now employees with atomic concrete pumping weren't even sure for those wild few hours if they would actually get this truck back and all the equipment in one piece. Watch as the suspect behind the wheel of this stolen heavy duty work truck towing a concrete pump pushed a driver right out of his way at Sherman Way in Tampa and Reseda during this hours long police chase. It was around 6 a.m. when an employee at Atomic Concrete Pumping says a suspect jumped into his work truck while he was about to fill up at a Northridge gas station and that suspect took off. The equipment worth more than $100,000. During the chase, one woman in an SUV starts yelling at the suspect through her window. The suspect makes a U-turn at Topanga Canyon and continues to evade police. Officers make attempts to throw down spike strips that do seem to work eventually flattening the tires. The suspect driving on the rims. He eventually surrendered in Canoga Park. The employee who had his work truck stolen on his way to a job talked about just how quickly it all happened. And just are you okay? Yes, I'm good. What happened? You're you're stopped at a gas station and then I just the truck just took off. You were you didn't even know. Like no, walk I me just, through. I was sitting there was putting my information into the pump and then I heard the e-brake get released and the truck was gone. Did it knock you over? Or no, just, just no, no. I was I was scooted over enough. I was fine. Did you call police? Like what? I, I called. I already made my my statements and reports and stuff. Yeah. All right, back here live. So the owner off camera told me here with Atomic Concrete Pumping that he actually jumped in his own vehicle and started following the suspect during that chase for quite some time, even making eye contact with him. The employee of Atomic Concrete Pumping also told me that that suspect made a mess on the inside of this truck. You mentioned that yellow can. That was beer. The suspect was drinking beer, sprayed it all over, threw trash around. Again, that suspect in custody now, though, with the LAPD. Live here in Canoga Park, Jasmine, VLK Cal News. All right, Jasmine, thank you for that.